Okay, guys, I'm going to show you how to uh, take a, like a three-point hitch and like a attacher attachment and make it for a front-end loader. Let's do this. So first thing you want to do is pull up and find you what you want to do. We're going to use the mower. Okay, first thing you want to do is save your file in case you uh, have a mess up or something. So then you find the XML file. You edit it. Okay, so once you have your XML file up. Okay, so here's some of the different things. Here's like the PTO RPMs. I'm not 100% sure what that does, but this one is like PTO power needed. So however high this is up, this is how much power you need. This is how fast your tractor, I think, will go. I ain't real sure on that. I did that once on the sprayer, but I tried to mess with this on this mower, and it didn't work. I couldn't get it to go fast or slow. Maybe the tractor didn't have enough power. That could be what it is. I was using to try to I was trying to use it on the bobcat. So what you want to do is come down here to input attach your joints. Okay, so right here says implement. So what you want to do is minimize this and then go to something that has uh, something that would have that. So the front end loader thing would work. So let's go down here to the uh, one of these bell forks or grill, whatever, whatever has hay bell forks and grab this front loader. Or you can just type it in by hand, it's all lowercase. See, I wasn't, I couldn't remember. So then you go back over here, I do copy that and go right where your implement joint type is at and then paste that in there. Okay, we have front loader. Now, up here, let's see, up here there's on the work area on some of this there I don't know if this is all, how everything is but it says uh, disable backwards false I guess if you would have this if you put that true you couldn't use it for the front you'd have to go backwards all the time so and same with this one okay so we have all that so we want to save it so I'll save that now I'm gonna show you okay so now that's that's in there good so let's go back to our one we was messing with. Okay, so now let's say if your your uh, front end loader ain't hooked up right, it's like inside the uh, piece of equipment that you're wanting to use, and it just doesn't look right. Okay, let's go in and move the joint uh, attacher thing. So again, we hold our Alt on the right side of the keyboard, and hold our uh, left mouse click and scroll with the mouse wheel. And if you're wanting to know how to speed your, this, so this way, like, if you want to go up and down faster, up by your uh, backspace, to, by your plus sign, you push the little underscore thing, that will take it down, just, just push the little dash, and plus sign over on the numpad makes it go up. So now, we're at 27, we go a lot faster, but we want to turn that back down. Because sometimes that helps to get in and stuff. Okay, so now what you do is you go up here to the top of here. You find where it says attach joint. Attach your joint. Okay, so we're going to say probably the arms are going to be inside the thing. So we'll just go ahead and push it up a little bit. And over, we'll just go about right here and up. Okay, so now that's good. Let's go save it. Because these, these cameras only are built in. They'll just like work cameras. They ain't gonna focus wherever then you close this out and then you can minimize that or close that out okay so now let's go in. all right now since we're in the game here's our cutter that we did there we go you have it you can raise it up it's a little big for the this little tractor tilt it like I said like right under here you can see where it's clipping through now we can adjust that by moving that thing up and down then you just turn it on Let's go cut some grass with it. This way you can turn it. No kind of stuff. Good thing we have full wheel drive, huh? Okay, so let's go ahead and cut some grass. See, it works pretty good. So that's how that is. Hope you guys like my videos. Please uh, subscribe, like, and share. And if this didn't help or you want something else to know something else, I will, if I know it, I will let you know. Just ask. Thanks. Bye.